everyone. Happy Monday. It is a new week. I'm up. It's early. The alarms are going off again. Um, Mason is back to school, back to work, back to baseball this week, all the things. Um, Thanksgiving break is over. <laughs> but coming downstairs, I am okay with being up early. It's still dark out because my house is decorated for Christmas. We did that over the weekend. Besides, normally I would have the Christmas tree lit up right now, but if you guys watched the last vlog, you know what happened there. So, fingers crossed, tree, new tree is supposed to be delivered on Wednesday this week, so stay tuned for that. Um, like I said, we're back to baseball. We got baseball games, baseball practices. I'm getting my tooth finally fixed from when I cracked it, so that's exciting, and I have, an appointment today. So all the things, it's gonna be a busy week, but we're up, drinking some coffee. Let's have a good week. Look at Ace. Ace didn't even wanna get up today. Are you tired? Do you have the Monday blues? Yes, <laughs> he said yes. Oh, I know, buddy. I'm sorry. You get to nap all day, though. I gotta work and do all the things. You're lucky. Good morning. You ready to go back to school? No, <laughs> no, no, no. But hey, he's up, he's ready, he's about ready to head out. But you guys, I wanted to, as the sun's coming up, I wanna show you guys one of the best things we bought, or Jack bought, I guess I should say, for his Christmas light display outside was this little thing. I literally hit one button and all the lights go off. I love it, so I don't have to go outside and turn off every single Christmas light that we have out there. I don't have to go out in the cold, it's perfect. So the sun is starting to come up. I'll leave it on so you can you can um, pull out and go to school and see our Christmas lights before I head to school. Hopefully that'll put you in a little bit better mood. Love you, don't be late, have a great day. Good night. Good night? Good morning, good morning Mason. <laughs> Highly recommend you guys get that for your Christmas light display. Well, you guys, I am about to leave earlier. I said an appointment, um, not a fun appointment, like getting my hair done or something. So if you guys remember, I don't know how many weeks ago, we were on our way to the Diamondbacks Phillies game with Ace in the car, because we were actually dropping Ace off at me and my papa's house to watch him while we were at the game. We were rear-ended, so if you watch that vlog. Finally, it is time to take the car in to get an estimate to see how much damage was done and all that kind of stuff. We've been driving around Jack's car with a, a now we in the back because we got rear-ended. Haven't been able to use the trunk for, I feel like it's been over a month, you guys. I don't even know, that was, seems like forever ago. That's what I'm off to do. Hopefully it doesn't take too long. <laughs> Welcome home from school. I'm the best mom ever. On my way home, I grab, well, I needed to go to the store to get garbage bags because I realized I took the trash out this morning and we are completely out of garbage bags. So that was a must. And then I knew Mason was getting home from school so I picked up some Wendy's. I got myself um, their chili. I know it's like controversial, like who likes their chili? I do. <laughs> a lot of people say it's disgusting because I guess they use the leftover burgers from the day before but I think their chili's good. What do you think, Mace? I've never had You never it. had their chili, well. You can bag. have a, yeah, he, he's the biggie bag boy. But I'm back from the body shop, and the guy, after he did the estimate, came in, he goes, he hit you pretty hard. I was like, yeah, the guy said that he just came off his break. No, he plowed into us. Um, so unfortunately, because of that, a lot needs to be fixed. So for sure, the back bumper, um, the trunk, which is stuff that I knew just by looking at it, um, and then all the other stuff that he was talking about that I have no idea. I think one of the things might have been like the exhaust. I don't know, there's a whole bunch of stuff. In fact, he said once they get the car in the shop and start pulling it apart, there might be more stuff, more parts that they need to order for it. And we're looking at least two weeks the car is gonna have to be in the shop. So when I was talking about getting the rental car earlier, that is a definitely must. There's no way we can go two weeks without a car for Jack. So that's fine. So they should be calling us in a few days um, once it goes through all the insurance and all that kind of stuff. And then once they order the parts, once the parts come in, 
we'll take the car in and start the process of getting it fixed. Perfect timing, right around the holidays, yay for us. All right, I'm gonna sit down and eat my chili while, while it's hot. I felt like chili because it's kind of cloudy out. It is cloudy. How was school? Great. <laughs> Are you glad to be back? Oh, look at this guy. No. Thanks, bud. He's put in the trash bag. You didn't throw anything in there today, did you? Yeah, what? You didn't throw any trash in there, did you? It's like floating in the bottom. That's why I left the lid off so that you would be like, oh, no bag in there. All right, time for some lunch. Happy Tuesday, everyone. A little sweaty, just worked out, which feels good because I took a little bit off because I had been so sick. So it feels good to work out again. And then I walked the dog this morning, which poor Ace wasn't getting walks either with me not feeling 100%. I remembered that I had a whole bunch of donations set aside in bags because the truck is coming in through the neighborhood today to pick up donations. So we ran back home because they have to be out by a certain time. I don't know when the truck's gonna drive by, but I would be upset if they drove by while I was out walking Ace. So I was like, let's go Ace. So we jogged home and then I went upstairs and got on the bike to finish my workout. So feels good to be back at it, especially because Christmas time brings all the snacks and treats and all the, the bad things that go into our bodies. So it feels good to sweat it all out. Hopefully only a couple more days it's still scheduled to come deliver my Christmas tree tomorrow, so hopefully that happens. But happy Tuesday. We're back at it, guys. Back to working out. Happy Wednesday, everyone. Mason, guess what that means? What? You're halfway to the weekend. He just walked in the door from school. Um, I don't know why he's looking at the Dick's, like Christmas, Dick's Sporting Goods Christmas ad. I'm sure there's plenty of things in there he would like to be underneath the Christmas tree. But you guys, it is Wednesday, so if you know, I've been talking about it, our new Christmas tree is supposed to be delivered today. I've been patiently waiting, didn't go anywhere all day today because I don't want a very expensive Christmas tree to be sitting out front. So now that Mason's home, I can finally leave because I need to get to the, I want to go to Walmart to get a new extension cord just in case for some reason the tree had issues on our end. Like maybe, I mean, our extension cord is working it's fine, we used the blow dryer. I went upstairs, I don't know why I randomly brought my blow dryer down. I was like, let's see if the blow dryer works. If the blow dryer works, then it's not the extension cord. And that all works fine. So it's definitely, probably not our extension cord, but the extension cord is older. So Jack's like, let's just get a new one just to be sure. So I wanna go to Walmart and get that. And I also can get something to make for dinner because unfortunately, we were supposed to have a baseball game tonight, but it got canceled. Mason came home yesterday and said the game was canceled. Stinks, but it is what it is. So no baseball tonight, so I can make dinner. So that's the plans. How was school? I love it. He's wearing his retro, I don't know, what do you call that? Vintage, vintage. I'm learning, Mason. Hi, hi brother, I'd be lazy. So yeah, we are patiently, patiently waiting for the Christmas tree. Hopefully it shows up, you guys. Christmas tree update, nothing. It's going on five o'clock. Mason's off to baseball practice. Fortunately, like I said, we were supposed to have a game, but he has practice instead. That stinks, but it is what it is. Um, Jack's out for a run, and I'm just patiently waiting for a knock on the door with my Christmas tree. But you guys, I haven't even got an email saying that it shipped that it's on its way, nothing. Just the original email saying thanks for the purchase, delivery date, Wednesday the 29th. I don't know, I just feel like something's wrong. I don't think it's gonna show up, so. No Christmas tree yet. I did get the extension cord and Jack helped me move the couch out and we got that all plugged in, ready to go. So now we're just waiting for the Christmas tree. Good morning, everyone. It's Thursday. Yeah, the tree never showed up last night. I didn't think it was going to. I was hopeful, but I don't know, just had a feeling. So I know it's the holidays. I know things can get delayed, so hopefully that's the issue. But if not, we're gonna have to get a hold of Sam's Club and be like, you know, is it coming and it's not? Because if it's not, I will go to plan B. Because I definitely want a Christmas tree for this Christmas. I'm up, I gotta go get my tooth finally fixed, completely fixed. This has been a process, you guys, and it's so gross because the partial is like turning like black, so it looks like I have a nasty tooth. It's so embarrassing when I smile, 
but today's the day I get to go get that fixed. I'm gonna head out, do that, and then today is game day, so finally. Oh, hi Ace, he's excited, he knows I'm leaving. Um, we have a baseball game tonight. They actually moved it up earlier because we were supposed to be getting some rain, A, and B, um, Mason's High School has a huge basketball game tonight, so coach, I love Mason's new coach, um, said, you know, let's move the game up so that you guys can all go to the basketball game. So, works out, win-win for everybody. Ace, I'm sorry, I think he went to WALK, but that's not gonna happen today, I gotta go. Fast forward a few hours. Ah, no more ucky black tooth. I got my crown in, I'm good to go. I can floss and do all the things. But you guys, you know it's cold out when this guy comes down, he's about ready to head to his baseball game in a jacket. I'm gonna freeze tonight. He just told me, mom, you better bring your heater tonight. <laughs> oh, why Arizona? <laughs> we beg for the cold weather and then it hits and we're like, never mind. <laughs> but yeah, it's gonna be a cold one. Um, thankfully they did, like I said, move the game up a little bit so the boys can go to the basketball game tonight because otherwise it would be really cold. But you out of here? Good luck. Have fun. Do your best. Try not to freeze. I'll try <laughs> all of the above. All right. Good job. Good luck. I'll see you at the game. Thank you. One down, boys. Touch it. Come on, boys. Yeah! Hey, baby! Nice job, boys! Check your bag, check your bag! Yeah! 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 Touch it. Touch it. Good job, That's fair, that's fair. Oh, KJ! Come on, KJ! Goodbye. Oh. Ooh, almost got a little... Happy Friday, everyone. It is pretty late in the day. I did a little shopping. Got some chores done, and here we are. Mason's about ready to head off to baseball practice already. But before he leaves, a package arrived. It's Christmas before Christmas, I guess. Um, this company we love. I wanted to give Mason this package before he goes off to practice because I think he's probably going to use it. And just to remind, well, I'll let him open it first, and then I'll give you a promo code to save you guys money because these make perfect stocking stuffers if you have baseball people in your life. So, all right, Mason. Before you leave for practice, I know you're in a rush. Go ahead. Beautiful. Beautiful. Jack's fabulous. There you go. He's gonna look nice at practice, nice and crispy. It's always good to have nice gloves and a crispy new arm sleeve. New arm sleeve, because <laughs> his is disgusting. Well, the best bad gloves in the game. You know, I'm still gonna wear the white. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's nice to have a black one now too. Yeah, like, yeah. Have a black uni, so that'll look I'll good with your black. Out. Yeah. So thank you to Jax, of course. My favorite, personally, for their batting gloves is this model right here. Oh, perfect. Okay. So if you guys. So yeah, they have different types. So. They have a bunch of models. They have the strap ones. These are obviously the thicker straps. They even have the thinner straps. Mm -hmm. And then they have the thick straps and then with like the cuff strap on top of it. Mm -hmm. So a lot of options, a lot of colors. Obviously they have arm sleeves here too. Fit Love pretty it. good. I like their arm you sleeves know, the best. Yeah, go ahead. Explain why you like them and I'll explain why I like them. Why do you, I don't know why you like them. But for <laughs> me, they, they fit the best. They're, okay. They're, they're like tight, but that's what you want. Mm -hmm. 
arm sleeves when they're loose they're just not as good quality like these are good quality here mm -hmm. and they just slide down but like when you're playing with this on like that this was... material like i don't have to yank it up every time like it's good it's fine it's always here and it's good for if you want a sleeve for like after it's pretty tight so for recovery for like recovery if mm -hmm. that's what you want or even just playing in it yep 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 okay so that's the baseball player why he likes the sleeve why the mom likes the sleeve because they hold up so if you have a kid that likes to dive back to bases they don't get the holes like the other brands because it's like a thicker material so that's why i like his arm sleeve that he has that he wears he wore last night to his game has had it for months 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 i think he's had it since these they came out, right? Was that your first one, maybe? Yeah, yeah that one came out. Yeah. Since they came out. Yeah. Literally, yeah. months. Loved it. Yeah. So there and you of go. Of course, the color of the white, it's obviously got the red Sedona dirt all over it. <laughs> the I mean, white. I, I chose the white color. The white so doesn't, uh, it we, happens, we try, so. we soak it, we try, but like I said, it but is the quality old. is still there. Yeah. And if you guys are Same. thinking about getting jacks for your kid for Christmas, shipping comes quickly, so that's good. You have plenty of time. B, you can get a discount using Bevo Fam. That'll give you a little bit of discount. So save your money. We got you. So links down below. Links down below. Yeah. yeah. Have a good practice. Yep. Happy Friday. Jack. Happy Friday. Happy Friday. You made it to the weekend. Yeah. yeah. Go yeah. for it. Thank you to Jax. Thank for you, sure. Jax. As always, we love it. So excited right now. All right trying to hold in my uh, excitement here. Mason is off to practice. Jack was in there editing, and all of a sudden, you guys, we got a package delivered. Yes, 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 finally. Supposed to be here Wednesday, but it came on Friday. Yay, Ace. All right, you guys, our tree is finally here, that tree saga, like, I've been talking about it for, what, a week now? <laughs> Go watch your Previous. Tree problems in Saturday. Go watch your previous vlogs. We explain all what happened. I'm gonna leave you guys hanging. I'm sorry, but it's Friday. Jack's editing. If you want to see this Christmas tree, you're gonna have to come back to our weekend vlog. Fingers crossed, you guys, it fits right there where Jack's standing. So on that note, don't forget to like this video, comment something in the comment section, subscribe. As always, thanks for watching. We will see you next time.